Hi, this is the Luba 2 AWD Robotic Lawn Mower. It's available on Amazon and I just thought that I'd share with you the unboxing and also the assembly of this robotic lawn mower. In terms of the assembly of this Luba 2, it's very, very straightforward. So there is just two things that need to be attached to the robotic mower. There's the bumper, the front bumper, and also the vision camera as well. So I'm gonna do the vision camera first, and then we'll go ahead and connect the bumper to the mower. So Luba have provided the 2.5 mil hex screwdriver, so you won't need to be finding that. That is in the package. So if it is in the wrong side, it simply just pulls out. So there's a Phillips head there or cross-headed screwdriver there. And then there's your hex on the other side. So you simply just pull that out and push that in. And then we're just ready to undo these four screws on the top. So, and then that just lifts off. I'm just gonna take the four screws out. So I'm just going to reuse these screws. There are four other screws in the pack, but I'm just going to reuse those. So why we're on the subject and why we've got the, the camera off and this open, this is the position for you to put your air tag. So if you wanted to put an Apple air tag in the mower that can go in there before we put the camera on. So you've got two connectors and then you've got your two connectors on the module itself. So black to black, it just clips in, it can only go one way. like so, and then those wires just tuck down and then the module, get that around the right way. And the module just sits on like so and then just screws back down with the same screws that you took the cover off. So I'm just gonna put that on. Okay, so that's our vision camera mounted to the mower. Next up is the bumper and that's really easy to attach. There are two screws that go to secure the bumper which is different from the Luba one. The Luba one you just put the bumper on and that was it. So there are two screws and again you will just use the same hex screwdriver once the bumper is on. So there's a connector coming out of the Luba and that just clips into this section here. But there's also two buttons here which you press to release the bumper and also you would need to press them as well as you're pushing the bumper in uh, for it to go in enough for you to do the screws up. So in terms of the way up it goes, there is a way, a correct way, and that is with the little light indicator pointing up. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, and I will do a close up of this so that you can see, the connector can only go one way and it clips in like so, and then you just line up your bumper like so, press the two buttons, then it just goes that little bit more, and then just with your supporting the luber behind, just push and it will clip in like so. And then what you can do is then use your two hex screws here to secure the bumper in like so. And that's it really, that really is all there is to the assembly. Yes, we need to put the antenna on the RTK station, but that really is the assembly of this Luba 2. I hope you found that useful.